garage. Gonna do the first oil change on this truck. I uh, haven't done it because it was under warranty, so I had to do it. So, pretty easy. The oil filter is on top. Uh, the cap is right here. We're putting 5W30, like it says, full synthetic mobile one. Putting a Fram filter 3614 from AutoZone. It's like six bucks, seven bucks. Drip pan and size 14, most likely. I don't know, never done it. So, what I like about it, I don't gotta lift it, I fit through there. So, let's start working on it. So filters on, uh, you do have to oil up the gasket and you want it hand tight. You don't want to over tighten this, it's going to be a bitch to take off. So now let's take off the dream plug. Like I said, I'll bet you it was a 14 and it is a 14. So the nut is right there. So I got my drip pan right here, loosen it up and let it drip. I cleaned it up, tightened it up. I used two oil pens because I didn't want them to overflow because when I deposit this on the big tank over there, it's going to overspill or I'm going to make a mess. So, yeah, so let's go up there and fill it up. I believe it takes 5.4 or 5.5. So we're going to put five quarts of oil first and then put the other half. And then check it, see where it's at, see if it needs more or not. Um, we got six quarts, so we should be fine. So, let's see. So, I already put five quarts of oil. Dipsticks on the left hand side. So. I'm gonna check the dipstick. Fuck. And drop the towel. So, I remove it first. Tried it up. And now I'm gonna put it in. And check it. So it looks like it's full, um, but I haven't started up. So you got no oil in the oil filter. So I'm gonna start it up and turn it off. See if it reads the same. If not, I'll add that half a quart. Started it up again. Taking off dipstick. Clean it again. Put it in there, it's a little hard, using one hand, so it looks like it is going to need the other half quart, it's hard to tell because of the light, but that's need it since it's full synthetic we're actually putting 5,000 miles um, I already put it six months whichever comes first 5,000 miles or six miles just a little reminder uh, just in case somebody else resets the light right now I'm gonna show you how to reset the light take this one well, my girl puts that one. Okay, so now we're gonna turn off the maintenance light that Toyota has, which is the oil change. Um, hold, you're gonna press 
and hold until you get to trip A. Hold and press the trip. Then key on, do not start the car. And then the maintenance light should be blinking and turn off like that one. And that's it. Let go of it and that's it. The light should come up in 5,000 miles. Um, and I recorded it up there just in case somebody else decides to uh, reset it by accident or whatever it is. So that's how you reset it. This is for 2005 to 2015 Tacomas. Um, 2016 is a different procedure. Probably similar. And that's it. That completes our oil change. Thanks for watching. Please like, subscribe, and leave a comment. I'm out.